<coughs> Hello everybody, welcome to our tutorial on predefined functions in Express Mozilla. In Express Mozilla, you can use basic math functions such as absolute value, exponential, ln logarithm and square root, rounding functions like ceiling, floor and round, and several trigonometric functions. Read and read lane are used in reading input files. Write and write lane can be used in producing outputs. There are a handful of functions and procedures to work with lists in Express Mozilla. Cut head and cut tail functions will be removing the first or last n elements of a list. To get the first and last n elements of a list, you can use get head and get tail. Get first and get last on the other hand will be only getting the very first or last elements. To split a list into two lists, you can use split head or split tail functions. To search for a particular element in a list, you can use find first or find last functions. Min list and max list will be returning the minimum or maximum element in that list. Here I have a list of string objects, my list. It has letters from A to F. First, I am cutting the first two elements from that list, and we will be left with C, D, E, and F. In the next operation, I am getting the first two elements of that list, which is C and D. Next, I am getting the last element of that list, which is F. And finally, I am searching for the element D in that list. And find first function is returning the index value starting from the beginning, which is 2. If you are working with an optimization model in Express Mozilla, you can use get objval to obtain the optimization solution value, get so to retrieve a value of a particular decision variable, get R cost to obtain the reduced cost of a variable, and get dual, get select, and get act to obtain the dual, select, or activity of a constraint. Let's now see this on an example. Here I have a very simple optimization model with a few number of constraints, an objective function made out of profit, where I am maximizing. After the optimization is over, I am retrieving the objective function value using get objval function. I am getting the decision variable values using get sol function. And finally, I am iterating through every availability constraint that I have and getting its dual, slack, and activity. There are several system functions and procedures in Express Mozilla that allows file and folder handling. fcopy, fmove and fdelete will be copying, moving or deleting a file. Find files function is useful in finding a list of files with particular content. You can get the size or time or status of a file using functions such as get fsize, get ftime and get fstat. Make there and make path creates directories or paths and remove files and remove directories will be removing files and directories. Let's take a look at the simple example of find files usage. Here I have a list of text object lsf and using the find files function I am populating lsf with a list of files with extensions mos and bim in my current working directory which is shown here. And finally I'm looping through lsf and write, I'm writing the file names and their sizes. There are also several functions can be used to work with zip files. To create them, you can use new zip, new tar. To unzip them, unzip, untar. Or to work with the content, you can use zip list and tar list. Finally, let's take a look at string and text manipulation functions and procedures. Substring function will be retrieving a portion of a string. To manipulate text objects, 
You can use copy text, cut text, insert text, and del text. To find out if a text object starts or ends with a particular text, you can use starts with and ends with functions. To find a string or replace for a string in a text, you can use find text, reg match, and reg replace functions. To lower will convert your text object into lowercase, and to upper will be converting it into uppercase. And if you have white spaces in the beginning or in the end of your text objects, you can use trim function. Let's take a look at another example. In this piece of code, we first retrieve the substring within hello world, starting from the position 3 and ending it with position 7, which is LLO. W. Next, we create a text object made out of letters from A to H. And then we cut it and we write down the section that we cut, which is C, D, E, F, and H. And at this point, T is left with the characters A, B, and H. Next, we are entering the text 1, 2, 3 inside and check if this text object starts with letter A. Next, we are converting hello world to uppercase and to lowercase. And finally, we are trimming the hello world string and writing it down. Thank you for listening to our predefined functions and procedures tutorial.